Ireland enjoyed a dream start to the contest when centre Thomas Daly made the initial break in midfield. He offloaded to lively fullback Darren Leader, who touched down for a terrific try. Daly managed to convert the tricky conversion from out on the right, giving Ireland a seven point advantage inside the opening five minutes. The under-19 side, coached by Colin McEntee, managed to force their way back into the French half. They were awarded a penalty and Daly was on target again from almost the same spot, increasing the cushion to 10-0. Ireland continued to take the game to the French in the opening period and they deservedly got through for a second try. Out half, Steve Crosby confused the French defence and got in behind them with some jinking running. The ball was recycled nicely and fullback leader put a lovely pass in front of Castleknock centre Tom Farrell who ghosted through the gap to touchdown. Daly narrowly missed the conversion from almost the same spot as his previous two kicks. A missed French penalty by scrum half Johan Domenech meant that Ireland went in at half time 15 points to the good. Ireland faced into a healthy breeze when the game restarted and the French also made five changes, giving them some fresh impetus. Replacement hooker Raphael Carbou, who lined out against Ireland in the under-26 nations this year, got through for his side's first try in the 53rd minute. Clement Otazo, who kicked four penalties in that under-20s encounter, came up short with a conversion attempt, but the try gave France a huge confidence boost heading into the final quarter. They closed the gap even further six minutes later when number eight Clement Ancelli got credit. When the forwards drove over at the end of a long push towards the Irish line, Otazo was successful with the conversion. Les Bleus were in the ascendancy at this stage and Bayon Zotazo got in for a try of his own with seven minutes remaining after a neat offload by centre Thibaut Regard. He then converted his own try which meant that Ireland were now trailing by 19 points to 15 in the closing minutes of the game. As the game moved into stoppage time Ireland applied pressure but they were caught on the break as another replacement, Etienne Quignou sealed a hard-earned 24-15 victory for his side with a try in the left corner.